The concern for the Delta variant is it's much more contagious than the original you know, coronaviruses we had in the United States. It doesn't seem to be more virulent, but it's 60% more contagious. So the concern is that this variant may spread more rapidly in unvaccinated individuals. The good news is, is that vaccinated individuals uh, are so protected from the Delta variant. So it's not a variant that is going to escape immunization protection. But in parts of the country where this saw a large percentage unvaccinated, you know, we could see a surge from Delta variant because it's so efficient in transmitting from person to person. We have not seen a single person have a serious illness from COVID who's been vaccinated. We've had a few patients admitted with mild illness who've been vaccinated and are immunocompromised, like an organ transplant patient or a patient with leukemia. They didn't end up in the ICU on a ventilator. We've not seen any otherwise healthy person come into the hospital, require oxygen, require medications, who's been vaccinated. We've been tracking every admission for vaccine status since the middle of March. A couple of you know, elderly patients who came in, tested positive, their illness might not have even been COVID. They didn't need oxygen, but the 98% of our admissions since middle of March have been unvaccinated. And not a single vaccinated patient has ended up on a ventilator. So the, the protection of the vaccines against serious illness in people with normal immune systems is really incredible. I think really have exceeded expectations.